Hi, I'm Tara with Smart Deploy. This is video one of our Getting Started series with Smart Deploy. First thing we're gonna do is talk about the system requirements for setting up your environment. All you need is a Windows 10 or newer computer or Windows Server 16 or newer an x86-based computer or an x64, one gigahertz processing power, and two gigabytes of RAM. So not, not too much. You really need to consider your space needs. You're gonna be dealing with large files. We actually recommend 500 gigabytes of space, but check for yourself, your environment. Next, you are going to need a virtualization tool. Smart Deploy supports a bunch of different ones. Uh, we support VM Workstation, VMware Player, Oracle VirtualBox, Hyper-V, VMware ESXi. We need virtualization software to create a virtual reference machine, which we'll cover in a later video but I do wanna tell you that it works best if your virtualization tool lives locally alongside your Smart Deploy console. And the reason for that is so that it can access your local drive a little bit more easily. And if you're going to use VMware ESXi, which I completely understand, make sure that you have turned on the nested virtualization before you begin. I definitely didn't make that mistake. Oh wait, yes I did. All right, lastly, uh, we are going to download your media today. With Windows 10, you needed to use Windows Media Maker to make your ISO. With Windows 11, we can download that directly. This is your first reminder, the latest version of Windows 11, which is Windows 24 H2 encrypts by default. And this is a problem because that will make it unusable for us. So I'm gonna tell you, number one reminder, we have to decrypt that before we can use it. We're gonna talk more about that later, but this is reminder number one. Okay, let's get our Windows 11 ISO. It's pretty easy. You're just gonna search for Windows 11 ISO. So let's just go ahead and do that. Open your browser, search, search, search. It's gonna take you here. Scroll down just a little bit. Search for Windows 11 multi-edition ISO for 64 devices. Yep, that's the one we want. And download now. Just put it somewhere you can remember. We're just gonna save it. And we're going to use that later. So for now, that's all we're gonna do. Come back next video. We're going to download our Smart Deploy console. I'll see you next time. For Smart Deploy, I'm Tara.